What if I told you that creating a fully interactive 3D world could be as simple as typing a few words or uploading an image? Sounds like something out of a futuristic movie, right? Well, today we're diving into the world of DeepMind's Genie 2, an AI that's rewriting the rules of virtual creation. Stick around because this might just blow your mind. Hey creators, my name is Lexi and welcome back to Artificially Inked. Today we're talking about Genie 2 from DeepMind, a tool that can generate entire interactive 3D environments all from a single text prompt or image. So what exactly is Genie 2? It's the next evolution of DeepMind's world generation AI. While its predecessor focused on creating 2D environments, Genie 2 takes things to the next level by generating fully interactive 3D worlds. Think about it, rich landscapes, realistic physics, and even character animations all powered by AI. Developers can interact with these environments just like they would in a video game. You can walk around, jump, swim, and even perform complex actions. Whether you prefer first person, third person, or isometric views, Genie 2 has you covered. All right, let's break down how Genie 2 works. It uses an advanced large-scale foundation model to create consistent, coherent virtual worlds. What does that mean? Well, if you move out of view of an object, Genie 2 remembers it's there and brings it back into focus when you return, just like in a real-world setting. This memory-like ability ensures the environment feels real and continuous. And the best part? It's all generated from a single image or text prompt, making it perfect for rapid prototyping and experimentation. But why does Genie 2 matter? Well, for starters, as this model becomes more stable, it becomes a game changer for developers. Imagine designing a video game where you don't have to spend weeks creating assets. Genie 2 lets you generate and test environments almost instantly. This could also be a powerful tool for training AI agents. By creating diverse, interactive scenarios, developers could test their AI in ways that weren't possible before. And for indie creators, this technology levels the playing field, opening up high-quality 3D creation without the need for massive budgets. Of course, no tool is perfect. Some developers have raised concerns about accessibility and pricing. As of now, Genie 2 isn't fully open source, which might make it challenging for smaller creators to adopt. And while these demos are impressive, there's always room to grow when it comes to realism and scalability. Still, for a tool that's just been released, Genie 2 is promising a new standard in virtual creation. Currently, Genie 2 provides around one minute of consistency. After that one minute mark, we begin to experience the normal AI hallucinations. So we still have a ways to go before this tool is a viable option. So where do we go from here? Imagine combining Genie 2 with VR technology to create fully immersive experiences or using it for multiplayer game development. The possibilities are endless, and I, for one, can't wait to see where DeepMind takes this next. What do you think? Could Genie 2 reshape how we create games, train AI, or even explore virtual worlds? Drop your thoughts in the comments, I'd love to hear them. And that's a wrap for today's deep dive into DeepMind's Genie 2. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button for more cutting edge AI content. Until next time, keep creating and stay inspired. Bye.